What is going on you guys? It's your girl Diana back at you with another YouTube video. Tomorrow is Saturday, December 3rd, which means that it's the Heading to Hoenn Mega Raid Battle event in Pokemon Go. So today I'm going to be going over what the best counters are for these raid battles so that you can get your favorite Mega Evolution. So if you're new here, make sure that you subscribe so that you are always up to date with the latest Pokemon news and give this video a thumbs up if you are a Pokemon Go fan so that we can push it out into the YouTube algorithm so that more people can see it. And if you would like another way to support the channel, please feel free to check out the merch store. There is a link down below in the description that takes you to not only my merch store, but also all of my other socials so you can keep up with what I'm doing on a daily basis. But let's go ahead and hop into the best counters for the Hoenn Mega Evolutions. Bye. Bye. To kick off the raid counter guide, I'm gonna start off with a fan favorite, Mega Sceptile. Mega Sceptile is a dual grass dragon type, which means that it's gonna be weak to dragon, fairy, flying, poison, bug, and two times weak to ice. So you're definitely gonna wanna bring the ice types to this raid battle. It's gonna have the fast moves Fairy Cutter and Bullet Seed, and the charged moves Leaf Blade, Dragon Claw, Earthquake, and Aerial Ace. And when catching it, you're gonna want a combat power of 1575 for the perfect IV, or 1969 in boosted weather. However, during the raid, it will have a combat power of 45,057, which means you're probably gonna need about three to four people in order to take this guy down. Some of the best counters that you're gonna wanna go into this raid with are Shadow Mamoswine with Powder Snow and Avalanche, Shadow Weavile with Ice Shard and Avalanche, Shadow Mewtwo with Psycho Cut and Ice Beam, Mega Obama Snow with Powder Snow and Weather Ball, and Galarian Darmanitan with Ice Fang and Avalanche. And of course, if you don't have the shadow versions of any of the Pokemon I mentioned, the shadow form of the non-shadow form works as well. Moving on to Mega Swamper. Mega Swamper is going to be a dual water ground type, which means it's going to be two times weak to grass. So for this one, you're gonna wanna bring in the grass Pokemon. It'll have the fast moves Mud Shot and Water Gun, and the charged moves Surf, Muddy Water, Earthquake, and Sludge Bomb, which Sludge Bomb is a poison type move, so you will have to keep that in mind if you are bringing a grass type to this battle. For the perfect IV, you're gonna be looking for a combat power of 1699 and 2124 for the weather boosted. During the raid, it will have a combat power of 45,153, which means you're probably gonna need three to four people for this raid as well. Your top five best counters for Mega Swamper are gonna be number one, Kartana, with Razor Leaf and Leaf Blade, Mega Venusaur with Vine Whip and Frenzy Plant, Zarude with Vine Whip and Power Whip, Tangrowth with Vine Whip and Power Whip, and lastly, Shadow Torterra with Razor Leaf and Frenzy Plant. You could also bring Shadow Venusaur instead of Mega Venusaur as well. And last but not least, we have Mega Blaziken, which is going to be a fire fighting dual type, which means it will be weak to Psychic, Ground, Water, and Flying. It'll have the fast moves Counter and Fire Spin, and the charge moves Blaze Kick, Overheat, Focus Blast, and Brave Bird. And for the perfect IV, you'll be looking for a combat power of 1627 or 2034 for the weather boosted. During the raid, it will have a combat power of 44,147, which means that you'll need about three to four people to beat this guy too. And the best counters to go into this raid with are going to be Shadow Mewtwo with Confusion and Psy Strike, Mega Alakazam with Confusion and Psychic, Mega Latios with Zen Headbutt and Psychic, Regular Mewtwo with Confusion and Psy Strike, and Shadow Moltres with Wing Attack and Sky Attack. But there you have it. Those are going to be the best counters for each of the Hoenn Starters Mega Evolutions. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. I'm sending out all the good vibes so that you can get your favorite starter in tomorrow's raids. But as always, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Love you.